A trebuchet is one of many types of siege machines used during the Middle Ages, having the ability to throw projectiles much heavier and farther than earlier catapults. It first appeared in China around the 4th century BC. There are two main types of trebuchet, traction trebuchet and counterweight trebuchet. Traction trebuchet are typically smaller. This design relies on human power as operators pull down on ropes attached to the shorter end of the beam to launch projectiles. Counterweight trebuchet are large construction with a strong base and frame with a beam. The beam can reach up to 15 meters or 50 feet in length, with some potentially even larger and are reinforced with leather, rope, or metal. The beam is attached to an axle suspended high above the ground on the frame, in such a way that the beam can rotate vertically through a wide arc, typically over 180 degree. The force amplified is primarily obtained by having the projectile section of the beam much longer than the opposite section where the force is applied, usually four to six times longer. A sling is attached to the longer end of the beam with two ropes to hold the projectile, one attached to the beam and the other hanging on a hook which detached when the projectile is launched. A counterweight box commonly filled with rocks, sand, or lead is attached to the shorter end of the beam and weights around 15,000 kg or 33,000 pounds to 30,000 kg or 66,000 pounds and some even might weight up to tens of thousands of kilograms and is connected to the beam with a hinged. A projectile is launched by lifting the counterweight into a certain height in which the beam act as a lever to pull down the longer end using a winch or tread wheels. Once the beam is lifted to the required height, it is tied down to a releasing mechanism and detached from the winch. The sling is then set by placing it on a guiding slot along the base of the trebuchet, enabling the sling to lengthen and thus extending the range and where the projectile is also loaded. The projectiles are mainly large stones but almost anything can be used including debris, rotting carcasses, or incendiaries. Projectile may weight up to 200 to 300 kilograms, and some trebuchet were reported of throwing stones weighing between 900 to 1,360 kilograms. When the beam is released, the counterweight box uses gravity to create a rotational force of the beam around the axle or fulcrum. The longer ends swing upward. Tossing the projectile with the sling as the weight of the counterweight is much greater than the projectile. The sling rotates farther, typically about 360 degrees, and therefore faster, transmitting this increased speed to the projectile. The projectile was set to release at an angle of about 45 degree, where the rope attached to the hook detached, throwing the projectile at an angle producing the longest range. It can throw a projectile up to 400 meters or 1,300 feet. After the projectile is released, the beam continue to rotate, allowing it to smoothly slow down on its own accord and come to rest at the end of the rotation. Overall length of the sling and adjusting the slings, release point is the primary way of fine-tuning the range and also changes the trajectory so that at the time of release from the sling, the projectile is traveling in the desired speed and angle to give it the range to hit the target, as the rest of the trebuchets are difficult to adjust after construction. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos.